can rhinos walk backwards? Um, yeah, they can. They can back back up. It's interesting to see that they're wondering about whether rhinos do these things. So that's pretty cool. You're here to do today? Yeah, I'm going to answer some weird searches about rhinos. Do rhinos eat people? No, rhinos do not eat people. Rhinos are herbivores. They eat plants only, really. So, uh, so no, they d definitely don't eat people. <laughs> so why do rhinos have such poor eyesight? Well, it's kind of one of their worst senses. They rely mainly on their sense of smell. They smell each other's dung. <laughs> which um, you know, can again tell which rhinos are in the area, whether there's a breathing female in season. Um, they also have really good hearing. Their ears are actually shaped in a certain way to allow them to move their ears all the way around and they can hear from all different directions. So they rely on that, they rely on the sense of smell. And so those two things kind of make up for the fact that they have terrible eyesight. Why do rhinos charge? So they charge usually as kind of a sign of aggression so in the wild, they would charge to maybe protect um, a young calf. They might charge at something that's novel in the environment, so um, kind of to tell them to, to get lost, really. <laughs> they charge at a lot of new people that might come into the area as well, so um, it's kind of just to assert their dominance, to show their size, and I guess like it, it's a way of scaring someone away. Why do rhinos have thick skin? So rhinos have about five centimetre thick skin, so it's super thick. The greater one-horned rhino in particular looks like it's wearing armour and it's mainly to kind of protect them maybe from other rhinos that are wanting to attack. It's also to do with um, predators as well. So if there are, there's a predator trying to attack or trying to attack um, a calf, um, it's much more difficult for them to you know, do some damage to the animal. So why do rhinos have horns? Well. They use their horns as like a defence mechanism between rival males um, over a territory, over a female. Um, they use the horns to fight, to spar. The size of their horn depends on how desirable a male may be. Why do rhinos get poached? So rhinos are poached for their horn. The horn is literally made of keratin, um, which is your, same as your hair, your fingernails. Poachers kind of go out, uh, kill the whole animal and just take the horn. Um, it's used in Asian medicine to cure from cancer to even a hangover. There's no scientific evidence in this, but it's, it still happens on a, a daily basis. Um, the statistic is every day two rhinos are poached um, for their rhino horn. So. You know, it's, it's pretty uh, shocking, really. Um, so why do rhinos get dehorned? Um, well, rhinos are dehorned because of um, the poaching industry. Um, so conservationists out in the wild um, dehorn the rhinos to stop this from happening. So a rhino that has no horns isn't seen as desirable from a poacher's point of view. Unfortunately, dehorned, um, the kind of the thing that makes a rhino a rhino, really, is taken away from them. It's such a shame, but I guess it's the, the only way that we're kind of working towards to being able to save them and let them live a normal life outside. Do rhinos have predators? Yes, they do have predators, kind of all the major predators. They have the lions, hyenas. Again, the main predator for a rhino is humans, unfortunately. So, um, yeah, that's kind of, it's not predators that are reducing the numbers. It is the, the human population that is doing that. Can rhinos walk backwards? Um, yeah, they can. They can back back up, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure whether they'd choose to, really, but yeah, I, I don't think it's something that they can't do. Do rhinos have teeth? Yes, rhinos do have teeth, very big teeth. They have the teeth um, set further back in the mouth, um, which they use to grind down the, the branches, the twigs, the leaves, and they kind of use their top lip to pull the branches and twigs into the mouth and use those big teeth to grind down those really tough uh, branches that we would use loppers to, to cut down, you know, they're really, really strong. The Indian rhinos, however, are slightly different. They have their teeth set further forward. Uh, because they're more grazing species, they um, <laughs> use them to kind of eat the grass, um, much more adapted to that grazing behaviour. They do also have a lot of teeth in the back of the mouth too to when they are yeah. in the branches and twigs like the black rhinos do. Can rhinos kill you? 
yes, rhinos can kill you if you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. So the black rhino is way more aggressive than, say, the white rhino. Um, it tends to be why you see more white rhinos in safari parks and um, le much less likely to charge at cars. The white rhino and the great one-horned rhino um, are a lot more kind of laid back, placid species, whereas the black rhino is really feisty, um, you know, charge a lot more. Um, you know, we wouldn't be going in the enclosures with them here at the zoo. Uh, you definitely wouldn't want to see one out in the wild um, and get too close, uh, especially, you know, if there's a, a mum protecting a calf. So yeah, definitely stay clear of them, but they wouldn't intentionally kill you to, to eat you or anything. It, it is just more of a defence me mechanism. Some things have surprised me a little, yeah. It's interesting to see that they're wondering about whether rhinos do these things, so that's pretty cool. Hopefully it answers some questions anyway, so.